morning, Bison, and welcome to the Bison Broadcast. Go. Please pause for the moment of silence. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Bye, Bison. Hey, Bennett here. Today is March 15th, 2024. Today the high is 60 and the low is 48. It will be a little bit raining, but there will probably be a rainbow, so probably in a little recess. Hey, I'm, hey, Bison. I'm here with Saturday's birthday. We have Ivy Roberts. Olivia Singleton, Ryan Singleton, and then for Sunday's birthdays, we have Joelle, Joette um, Bear, um, Finn Ward, and Violet Ward. Bye, Bison. Hey, Bison. Today's lunch is mac and cheese, chicken drumstick, roll, mashed potatoes, and steamed broccoli. We don't have school on Monday, so that means no breakfast. Bye, Bison. Hey, Bison. These are your announcements for this week. Today are 4-H meetings for 4th and 5th grade. Next week is spring break. Woohoo! When we get back from school, it's culture career week. Bye, Bison! Hey, Bison! We interrupt the Bison broadcast for some exciting news! Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls! This week's sports SEC tournament men's basketball is happening this weekend. I hope at least someone in school got tickets to the game. Bye, Bye Bison! Bison! I'm here with the principal challenge. Bye! Good morning, Bison. Ready for your principal's challenge. Next week is spring break. I know you are so excited. I hope you have good weather and get to enjoy your family. Your challenge is to do just that. Enjoy your family time, put some books on your reading log, and then when we get back, we only have nine weeks of school left. So enjoy your week, and then we will miss you so much, and see you when you get back. Your free challenge this week is to be kind and to be nice to your teachers. Hey, Bison, did you know that great white sharks don't have any natural predators? The only threats to them are humans. Also, sharks, they don't have any bones. They're made of cartilage. Bye, Bison. Hey, hey Bison, here's Miss Pond with your special feature of the week. I have to ask you, what's going on in fourth grade? There's a lot going on in fourth grade. In math, we're learning about fractions and decimals, and they have a big test this week. In science, we're learning about energy transfer and all the different ways you can transfer energy. And in social studies and ELA, they're learning about the Sons of Liberty, and they're writing and saying if they want the tea thrown in the harbor or to not throw the tea in the harbor. Well, that is a lot going on. Thank you for your time, Ms. Vaughn. Bye, Bison. Hi, Bison. Today, I'm recommending for you a book that's on the Book Madness bracket. What's up, pup? I think it's a really good book and that you should vote for it. This is what it's about. Dogs are communicating with us all the time, even without words. They could tell us that they want to play, get scratches, or say I love you from sniffing, sniffers and ears and muzzles and rears from tail wagging to tongue flicks and everything in between. What does your pup say? I think this is an amazing book. I think you should read it. Bye, Bison. Hey, Bison. Do you guys want to hear the joke of the week? All right, I'll give it to you. What does the pencil say to the other pencil? What? You're looking sharp, dude. Oh, thanks. You too. Oh, yeah. I know I am. Hi, Bison, and don't forget to be ready, respectful, and responsible. Brian Jones.